Hello guys, how are you all? Today in this video I am going to explain about very important words whatever we are using in the pharmaceutical industry that and all I am going to explain it. What is the full form it and what is the abbreviation of it? Like that I am going to explain. Just listen carefully. Let's get start the video. First one, what is the full form of QMS? QMS means Quality Management System. Second one, what is 21 CFR? 21 stands for Food and Drug. CFR stands for Code of Federal Regulations. Third one, what is GDP? GDP means Good Documentation Practices. Fourth one, what is PSI? PSI stands for Pound Force per Square Inch. Fifth one, what is WHO? WHO stands for World Health Organization. Sixth one, what is MHRA? MHRA stands for Medicines and Healthcare Products Regulatory Agencies. Seventh one, what is GMP? GMP stands for Good Manufacturing Practices. Eighth one, what is CGMP? CGMP stands for Current Good Manufacturing Practices. Ninth one, what is CAPA? C A P A. CAPA stands for Corrective Action and Preventive Action. Tenth one, what is FDA? FDA stands for Drug Administration. Eleventh one, what is FAR? FAR stands for Field Alert Report. Twelfth one, what is EIR? EIR stands for Establishment Inspectional Report. Thirteenth one, what is IC? IC stands for Ion Chromatography. Fourteenth one, what is FTIR? FTIR stands for Fourier Transform Infrared Spectroscopy. Fifteenth one, what is UATIR? UATIR stands for Universal Attenuated Total Reflectance. Sixteenth one, what is IUPAC? IUPAC stands for International Union of Pure Applied Chemistry. Seventeenth one, what is CRN? CRN stands for Change Receipt Note. Eighteenth one, what is GRN? GRN stands for Goods Receipt Note. Nineteenth one, what is ICH? ICH stands for International Council for Harmonization. Twentieth one, what is SD? SD stands for Standard Deviation. Twenty one, what is RSD? RSD stands for Relative Standard Deviation. Twenty two, what is accept AV? AV stands for Acceptance Value. Twenty three. What is 43 NF38? Here 43 NF38 we are using current USP version. NF stands for National Formulatory. Next 24th one. What is VWD? VWD stands for Variable Wavelength Detector. This is the detector we are using for the HPLC. Next 25th one. What is DAD? DAD? DAD stands for Diode Array Detector. This is the detector we are using for the HPLC. Next, 26th one. What is PDA? PDA stands for Photo Diode Array Detector. This is also one detector we are using for the HPLC system. Next, 27th one. What is FID? FID stands for Flame Ionization Detector. This is the one of the detector we are using for the gas chromatography. Next, what is RSL? RSL stands for Residual Solvents. 29th one, what is LIMS? L-I-M-S. LIMS stands for Laboratory Information Management System. 30th one, what is RH? RH stands for Related Humidity. 31. 
What is the full form of BMR? BMR stands for Batch Manufacturing Record. Whenever we are receiving the sample from the production, we are getting BMR report also. At the time, we have to check all the product details in the BMR. 32. COA. COA stands for Certificate of Analysis. Whatever we are doing the analysis, all the details, it is available in the COA. 33. LIR. LIR stands for Laboratory Investigation Report. If we are doing analysis or we are running the sequence, at the time any problem happened means we are going to take LIR, Laboratory Investigation Report and we will close it. Next 34. OOS. OOS stands for Out of Specifications. If the results are not within the specification limits means we are going to take OOS. Next 35. OOT. OOT stands for Out of Trend. OOT we are taking for the stability study samples only. If the results are within the specification limits but it is not matching to the previous results. At the time we are going to take OOT. Next 36. CU. CU stands for Content Uniformity. How much drug present in the tablet we are identifying by the content uniformity. Next 37. UOD stands for Uniformity of Dosage Units. Next 38. BDS. BDS stands for Base Deactivated Silica. This is the one of the column. Next 39. ODS. ODS stands for Octadecylsilyl. This is also one of the HPLC column. Next 40. RS. RS stands for Related Substances. This is one of the analytical test. We are identifying the impurities by the Related Substances test. 41. Form 482. This is US FDA one of the form they are giving for notice of the inspection form. Next 483. This is one of the form of they are giving US FDA people for the inspectional notice form. Next 484 means sample receipt form. Next I am going to explain about HPLC calibration using short words. DL. DL stands for detector linearity. IP. IP stands for injection precision. IL. IL stands for injection linearity. COT. COT stands for carry over test. ND. ND stands for noise and drift. WA. WA stands for wavelength accuracy. Next. GC. GC stands for Gradient Composition Test. These are all the tests we are using for the HPLC calibrations. This is about today's topic friends. If you have any doubts, please put a comment in the comment section. Thanks for watching my PharmaQC YouTube channel. Bye bye.